Hey everybody, welcome back to my art videos. So happy that you could join me today. Today we are going to be making an indoor art museum. Yay! So all you need is a fun room inside your house and your own artwork and a sign that you will create. So let's get started. Welcome to Miss R's Art Museum. So to begin my little tour, we're gonna come over here and I have my sign that says, welcome to Miss R's Art Museum, that's me. And then below I have my title of my museum called Then and Now. The reason why I decided to do this was because I have a bunch of abundance of a bit of it. Abundance of artwork from when I was four, and here's an example of when I was four painting. This, this is an example right next to it of one that I have recently um, done a little bit ago, probably a couple months ago. This is an artwork that I had back when I was in high school. Um, I love to do pottery, and so I had a really awesome art teacher too, and she was one of the reasons why I wanted to become an art teacher, so this is why I chose to put this in my little museum. Next to it was one of my older pictures. I honestly didn't really like it that much when I was younger, but I like it now because I can see where my art has changed and where I've improved. I put this here because you know what, everyone, we need to brush our teeth. So I have this as a reminder in my bathroom to brush my teeth every morning. Just kidding. No, I made this for an art project back when I was in college and it was one of my favorite types of art methods which is oil painting and that's why I decided to incorporate this. Coming along over here, I have my awesome brother Kyle back when he was younger. This artwork is important to me because I actually won the congressman's award with this artwork so I chose to hang it up. Um, fun little fact, I got my brother to make this face because I squirted him with a a little water bottle and he went like Oof. so one of my very first uh, abstract paintings as you can tell when you come over here that I like to paint pictures of people and draw pictures of people and portraits and try to make them look realistic this is my fun celebrity wall so up here can anyone guess who this is yes that's Captain Jack Sparrow and then Johnny Depp again over here in a watercolor form. Down here I have the famous Albert Einstein. And then I have Rihanna, who's one of my favorite singers. And then, of course, Brad Pitt. Coming around over here, we're going to conclude this little art tour with my last two paintings that I've done in college. The paintings are very important to me because, as you can tell from the beginning of the video, I started out with more of like realistic paintings and techniques and have changed my style to bigger and brighter and more abstract. So in this one you can still see I incorporated the face. Overall, the biggest thing that I want you guys to take away from this is that you're having fun, you're gathering your artwork, and after you put your artwork everywhere, you one have a title to your museum, you also have a welcome sign to your museum, and then a fun little challenge is that I want you to take your whole family on your own little art tour. So notice how on my video, as I walked around on my tour, I was describing the works of art and why they were important to me and some of the materials that I use for them. So remember that we need our intro sign, so our welcome sign, our title to what our museum is going to be about, and please make sure that this is relevant to your artwork. Now the last thing, all we need is our wonderful art creations that we've made over time. I encourage you to also look at the other art museums that we have available to us. We have a lot of resources out, I will link them below. So not only were you able to go on my virtual art tour, you can also go to the Louvre for free, which is in France. You can go to the Dever Art Museum for free, the Gregory Alicard Museum for free, which is up in Fort Collins, and I will, I'll make sure I link all those below. So I'm super excited that you were able to see my museum tour, and can't wait to see you next time. Bye. Bye. Over. See ya.